Right now, in America, someone is keeping a record of every call you make, who you call, and who calls you, when you talked, and for how long. These records go back for years, and they can obtain this information on you or anyone else, and you'll never know. Someone is watching. That someone is the United States government. But how did this happen in a country where the Constitution protects people's right to be secure against unreasonable searches? And even more importantly, what can you do about it? This is the United States Congress just hours after the 9-11 attacks. Like everyone else in the country, they're in shock and they don't know what will happen next. They only know one thing. They need to do something. Fast. The next month, Congress receives the Patriot Act, a 342-page document. The Attorney General, John Ashcroft, tells Congress they should pass this anti-terrorism bill in a week. Virtually no one in this chamber have any idea what's in that bill. Why should we care? Well, it's only the Constitution. It's only individual liberty at stake. The Patriot Act is signed into law just three days after it was introduced. Worse, buried deep inside the Patriot Act were provisions that sounded harmless, but were anything but, like Section 215. Its supporters claimed it would help the FBI find the bad guys. But over a decade later, the NSA and the FBI are misusing Section 215 to sweep up the information of ordinary U.S. citizens. Section 215 lets the government collect tangible things relevant to an authorized investigation. But the government now claims the records of every phone call you make, now and in the future, are a relevant, tangible thing. So Section 215 isn't just for suspected terrorists. The Bush administration claimed, and Obama agreed, that it could be used to get the call records of everyone in the U.S. Most members of Congress didn't know the law was being misused, and the program is overseen by a secret court where everything's classified. And it was this secret court, not Congress and not us, that decided your phone records are now up for grabs. But there is a way to end Section 215 right now. Congress inserted important safeguards into the Patriot Act, sunset clauses, little timers that require Congress to vote again on the most controversial parts. And if they don't, these sections expire. In June of this year, Section 215 has a sunset clause that's coming to an end. That means Congress has a chance to stop this secret program. We need your help. If we do nothing, Congress could renew this section of the Patriot Act. But if you speak out, we can stop them. Contact Congress now and tell them to end untargeted surveillance under Section 215 of the Patriot Act. And ask your friends to do the same. Let's make this the year that liberty and privacy triumph over secrecy and fear.